discussion of Naturally Yours. Good morning, mga kasabay. Mm -hmm. Always ready naman tayo. Yeah. <laughs> We are talking about the liver and Dr. Rice explained to us how important the liver is. Diyan, dumadaan lahat ng kinakain natin. Maybe good or bad, diyan pa rin dadaan. Chemical refinery siya ng katawan natin, kaya very important that we take care of it. <laughs> Now, we were discussing about diseases and uh, actually, pag, uh, with, if we're talking about uh, the liver, we always have this notion that we have to detoxify ourselves kung ma meron tayong problema sa atay. Unfortunately, detoxification of the liver is the most abused sa natural medicine. <laughs> Why is it abused? Kasi lagi natin sinasabi na kapag may sakit ka sa atay, dapat mag-detox ka. The problem is, hindi naman natin alam kung paano talaga ginagawa ang proper detoxification. I just want to make this brief and concise. When you talk about uh, detoxification in natural medicine, we are talking about three stages. We always believe that cleansing is, is it. Cleansing is the end of detoxification, but we have to consider that three stages ang detoxification. Number one of this it is uh, cleansing. Ibig sabihin, kumain ka ng pagkain na pwedeng mag-cleanse ang ating katawan. Ano-ano ang mga pagkain nag-cleanse ng ating katawan? Ibig sabihin, nag-release ng dumi. Ito ay mga papaya, ito ay mga fiber-rich food coming from whole food ito, hindi synthesized food ng sinasabi natin. Of course, pag malinis ang katawan mo, number two na gagawin natin, second stage will be to uh, regenerate. Dapat kailangan kumain tayo ng pagkain na kayang mag-regenerate ng ating cells, maybe ailing or mga disease cells. Ayan. Number three, dapat uh, i-consider natin ang assimilation. Hindi pwede na nag-regenerate tayo pero there's no capacity or ability ang ating katawan na mag-assimilate. That's why dito pumapasok ang importance ng minerals. Make sure, subukan natin na painumin ang ating mga anak or ating mga kasambahay ng mineralized water. Kung maaari, huwag nating painumin ang mga dead water dahil ito ay uh, hindi masyadong uh, beneficial sa ating katawan. Now, we have talked about uh, uh, detoxification no? proper. Uh, very brief lang yan, pero sana naintindihan natin yung ating explanation. Number two, number uh, part two would be, paano natin nourish yung ating katawan? Well, ever since naman, kahit sa mga uh, uh, ancestors natin, nalilinis naman nila ng properly kaya sila humahaba ang buhay. I'm sure doktora will agree na kapag kinip natin ang ating liver na healthy, we can live a long, long time. Ayan. What are the nutraceutical products that I love? When it comes to proper detoxification, I always love the bee products. What are these bee products? Ito ay mga nanggaling sa mga byproduct ng mga bees natin. Number one of which, which is a very, very well-known uh, good food, would be the honey. Just make sure that when you choose the honey, kailangan ito ay hindi, uh, uh, walang, walang mataas na sugar, especially glucose or corn syrup na nabibili natin usually sa mga ordinary natin ng mga groceries. Number two, isa sa pinakagusto ko na pagkain would be the bee pollen. These are just the droppings of the bees. But this is considered as the best food or a brush of the gods. Yan, dal kompleto sa amino acids. And amino acids, importante yan, the essential and the non-essentials for the growth of our cells or regeneration of our cells. Any pwedeng new cells, pwedeng uh, disease cells. And of course, Uh, bee propolis. Ang bee propolis naman, nagsiserve ito sa antiseptic sa ating katawan. Nagtataas ito ng killer cells. And of course, favorite ng anak ko ito. That's why my son is very tall. My son at the age of four is almost four feet tall. Because my son has been drinking royal jelly since he's 10 days old. Now, when I say royal jelly, I'm referring to the real royal jelly. Ito yung mga nakukuha natin na minsan, eh, hindi lang minsan, nandyan siya na makikita natin ito sa, royal, uh, sa bee honey. Uh, naka, nakalagay yan dyan. At meron din akong nakukuha na liquid form of royal jelly. Ang royal jelly ay napakahusay sa regeneration of the cells at ginagawa niyang mas mabilis ang growth ng isang bata. Ayan. Sana may natutunan kayo sa ating live na live na segment this morning. Ito po ang Naturally Yours.